video today, we're going to be talking about the SimpliVac vacuum casting system and how it can help you to impregnate your porous or cracked samples better using epoxy resins. The SimpliVac system applies a vacuum to the sample and allows you to pour under vacuum and then put multiple vacuum cycles through. The recommended method for doing vacuum impregnation is to apply a vacuum to the sample and then once the sample is under vacuum, to pour the resin over the sample so that the resin can get deeply into the sample and the air is already removed. What we've also shown is that doing multiple vacuum cycles helps you to greatly improve the penetration of the epoxy into the sample. This machine uses supply tubes to carry the resin from a cup outside the machine and allow you to pour directly into the mold. It's very easy to plug in, put the supply tube in here, drop it down into the valve, close the valve, and we're ready to go. Now actually, there's a couple of different ways we can set up the supply tube, either to the back of the machine, when we have a small cup that fits into the machine, or if we want to use an external cup, we can take the plug that was uh, in the machine, attach it to the side, and hold the tube in a larger cup. Impregnating a sample so running a vacuum uh, cycle is actually pretty straightforward. Drop the sample under the supply tube, close the lid, and press this button that applies a vacuum onto the sample. So this is taking all of the air out, and as you'll see, I don't have to press down the lid or do anything else in order to get that to create the vacuum. I just have to have the lid uh, down. Once we've got to the vacuum that we want, and we're ready to pour. To pour resin into the sample, simply release the valve here. The resin will flow through the tube and into the sample. We can see through the top very clearly how full the sample is. So we can fill to the top if we need to. And then we simply rotate the wheel to the next sample and fill again. Pouring multiple samples is very straightforward. Um, we release the valve fill the sample with epoxy, and then use the adjusted wheel to move to the next specimen, release, next specimen, release, next specimen, release. So as you can see, a, the epoxy can be dispensed in a very controllable way. Now this is the only machine on the marketplace that it's able to cycle through different vacuums without the user having to press down on the lid. So this is completely self-sealing and it will go back to ambient pressure and then back up to the cycle vacuum pressure that you want automatically. So the user can set it and walk away. When it gets to the end of the cycles, the machine will depressurize and just give you an audible uh, notice that it's got to the end of the cycle so you can come back and remove your samples. You see that it says that it's ready and we can just lift the lid and take our samples out. At the end of the vacuum cycles, you should take the samples out to cure under ambient conditions or in an oven, depending on the epoxy that you're using. So we simply take out the valve lift the lid, and then we're able to lift up the whole tray of samples at once out of the machine.